Welcome to Wi-Fi Neon Flex User Instructions. This video will help you connect your Wi-Fi Neon Flex light to your Wi-Fi network so you can begin to control your light via the smartphone app controller, Magic Home Pro. Firstly, you will download the app called Magic Home Pro. This app was available from the App Store or Google Play Store. You can scan the QR code or go directly to the App Store and search for Magic Home Pro. How to connect via Wi-Fi to the controller through your smartphone or tablet after your light has been connected to your power supply for the first time. Open the Magic Home Pro app, click on the plus icon in the upper corner and click Add Device. You'll be then asked to create a Magic Home account. Complete the instructions, then log into your new account. Open your Wi-Fi settings in your smartphone system app. Select the network with the name LED Net and wait a moment till connected. Then return to the Magic Home Pro app. Please note, after your controller is connected to your home Wi-Fi, it will not display on your Wi-Fi network list anymore. When and only when you register and log into your account in the Magic Home Pro app, you can control your lights with the app as long as there is Wi-Fi, 3G or 4G internet connection for your smartphone or tablet. The default setting of the Wi-Fi controller is four channels in a sequence of red, green, blue and white. If you want to change the output channel, here are the steps to follow. Ensure the power point is off, then plug in the transformer. Plug the transformer back into the power point, then turn the power on. When the lights are illuminated, depress button B for two to three seconds. The flickering white light means you have successfully changed the output channel to blue, red, green, white sequence. Depress button G to change the output channel to green, red, blue, white sequence. Depress button R to change the output channel to red, green, blue, white sequence. In red, green, blue, white version, depress white button for the red, green, blue and white channel. See the buttons on the remote for flash, strobe, fade and smooth, or the coloured buttons for non-dynamic lighting buttons of various colours. Open the Magic Home Pro app and on the bottom right select Colour. You can adjust both red, green, blue as well as the brightness of the colour. It is possible in this function to adjust and store five custom created colours and the brightness levels by depressing the DIY button for two to three seconds. In the function setting, you can select your favourite colour and gradually jump or strobe between the functions. Press the menu Customs and then Add New Mode. By briefly pressing one of the selection rectangles, you can change the colour. By depressing for two to three seconds, you can delete the color. Also in this capacity, 20 gradients are present. In addition, you can adjust the speed of the gradients with a slider. Magic Home Pro allows you to create different groups to control more than one controller. For example, if you have two controller units, you can use one system in your living room and the other on the patio. The group function allows you to either control these systems individually or to group them together as one unit. You can have your lights automatically turn on and off in a specific time by setting the timer function. The controller has a built-in timer function. To do so, press on the top right next to the on and off switch to clock on. 
then the selection menu will be shown with the time. The timer will not operate when the power supply is interrupted. In this case, start to resynchronize. In this function, the connected LED light lights up depending on the volume or noise from the outside like a microphone. This also works when playing music or there is a noise from outside. The light will begin dancing based on the different rhythms. The microphone sensitivity can be adjusted by the slider. In this function, connected LED will illuminate with the rhythm of the music that will be played on the smartphone or tablet. To do this, select the menu item music and then select your music library on the smartphone. There are four music styles, rock, normal, jazz, or classical. The iOS system needs to download music files in iTunes and copy audio files from computers iTunes to your smartphone. You can select the music rhythm. The light color changes automatically with the music rhythm. Android systems need to download the music files to the phone for use. In this function, you can select a color with the smartphone or tablet, where you point the camera of your smartphone or tablet to an object. The selected color will be displayed from the connected LED light in the red, green, blue spectrum. In this function, you can select a color with the smartphone or tablet where you point the camera of your smartphone or tablet to an object. The selected color will be displayed from the connected LED light in the red, green, blue spectrum. This can be done manually, transmitted to the LED light with manual, capture color, or switch to auto, and the LED light will show immediately the color which has been selected on the camera. In order to control your smart light with Amazon Echo or to control them remotely, you need to create a Magic Home Cloud account and sign in. Add your light and modify the name, make sure that there is at least one smart light in the device list, and to enable your lights for remote control. On home page, depress the light name two to three seconds to rename. Enable Alexa skill by downloading the Amazon Alexa app, open the app, and under the skill section, search for the Magic Home skill. The account and password must be the same as you created in the Magic Home Pro app. Log in and discover devices. Use your Magic Home account you created in step one to sign in to Magic Home Skill. The next step is to discover your smart lights from the Alexa app. You can say, Alexa, discover devices. Once Alexa has completed discovering your smart light, they will be shown in the smart home in the Alexa app. Control your light by issuing voice commands. Supported commands include Alexa, set lights to 0 to 100. Alexa, turn lights on or off. Changing color options for Alexa control your smart device. Blue, crimson, cyan, fuchsia, gold, green, lavender, lime, magenta, orange, purple, red, salmon, teal, turquoise, violet and yellow. Create your Magic Home Cloud account. In order to control your smart light with Google Assistant or control them remotely, you'll need to create a Magic Home account. You may have already done this when setting up your smartphone app. Follow these steps in the beginning of the video. Then make sure that there is at least one smart light in the device list and to enable your light from the remote control. On the home page, Depress the display name for two to three seconds to rename your light. Then click Home Control on the app and select Magic Home Wi-Fi. The account password must be the same as the one that you created in Magic Home Pro app. Enter your app account and password to finish the account linking. Use the Magic Home Cloud account used in step one. Your lights will be listed on the Home Control interface. You can now control your lights by issuing voice commands. The supported commands are say OK Google or Hey Google, then turn on or off lights. 
changing colors on your Google Home control of your smart light. Blue, crimson, cyan, fuchsia, gold, green, lavender, lime, magenta, orange, purple, red, salmon, teal, turquoise, violet, or yellow. Thank you for your purchase and we hope you have many happy hours of enjoyment with your Wi-Fi Neon Flex.